How's it going? Today I want to talk about these dining room chairs. So my wife decided to buy four of these. This is one of them. It's like this fake leather, but it's actually of pretty good quality. Like I've had some that are fake leather that end up falling apart. This one is actually very well built. You can see how firm the seat is. That was one of the things that stuck out right away whenever I sat in these. Now as a guy, like I look at chairs as kind of like, you know, whatever, it's just a chair. This actually has a lot going for it. The back, it's pretty wide, but it's not like super tall. This is, I think, the 36.8 or 38.6 height. The dimensions are in the listings, but it's a pretty basic chair, but it's very sleek and elegant, and it does have a really wide seat as well. And I think that's really important. Now, when it came to putting this thing together, if we look at the bottom here, it's, uh, you know, pretty simple. It's got like bolts that go into the side here. There's two on each leg, and then there's also these two in the front to kind of hold down the um, actual back part of it. So whenever you're putting this together, you know, it's got the instructions, but you pretty much just want to do everything slightly loose before tightening everything down. I had no problem getting it together, but I do like to use my own tools. It comes with a set of tools, but you know, they're just little Allen wrenches and sometimes they're kind of a pain to use. But like I said, I like these because like the legs are nice and rectangular the big base at the bottom, and then like I said, the back is actually fairly wide, but they're not overly heavy. They're actually pretty lightweight, so it makes it really easy to move around, and sometimes we like to pull it over here to use as a desk chair for her desk. 